we were all shocked when uh, Java's mother revealed that Java actually has a wife. But what was more shocking was the allegations that Lady Zama made against Java about their past relationship. Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel, TV Scoop Entertainment, where I'll be bringing the latest scoop in South Africa. Do make sure that you do subscribe to my YouTube channel, TV Scoop Entertainment, if you haven't done so, and that you hit the notification bell for more TV Scoop Entertainment videos. Java's mother beautifully praised him before he could get on stage and perform, and we were all shocked to learn that as Java actually has a wife. He's been married, I don't know for how long, but he's been married for quite a while. So a lot of people are asking themselves, but Java just broke up with Lady Zamar a few months ago. What is happening here? So a lot of people they dragged Lady Zamar into this marital affairs situation and this show did open a lot of wounds in Lady Zama wounds about stuff that we did not know happened in that relationship. Upon my investigation on whether Java kept her wife a secret, I came across these pictures of the woman that was introduced by Java's mother during his concert at the Sun Time Arena Square in Pretoria. Yes, Lady Zama was dragged into the situation because a lot of people wanted to know that was she dating a married man and did she know that Java actually had a wife to start with. Earlier this year, Lady Zama confirmed that she was dating Java from 2017 up until 2019 and they kept the relationship private because that's how Java wanted it to be. To respond to all the tweets that dragged Lady Zama on whether she knew that Java was married or not. Lady Zama noted that the reason why she broke up with Java is true was because that Java was allegedly abusive to her and not because of some circumcision issues. She also went on to explain further that she was abused verbally and sexually and she was lied to and cheated on. Well, these allegations by Lady Zama caused a storm through our social media because a lot of people could not believe that Java could do such a thing. One other user went on to say that Java's music and what he is accused of are totally different things. I'm so disappointed in him, man. Hashtag Java, hashtag Lady Zama. Other users also went on to, you know, give their opinions about the abuse. Others were like, so basically you don't believe that Lady Zama was abused by Java. Forget how much you love his music. Music, look at him like every boy that's abusing women and children out there he's not his music call him out to order I won't even call him trash he's a human being that needs to be called out for his ish behavior hashtag Java hashtag Lady Zuma what's really sad is that Lady Zuma kept this to herself and she never opened up to the public about her abusive relationship she had with Java so we thought so there was this other tweet that Lady Zuma made a a month back a month back in which she noted that abuse people are closer than you think abusers are usually those you'd never suspect will do it the ones with good social standing people of influence get away with much easier but abusers everywhere i speak directly from experience about 95 percent of the time i speak from it so there you have it guys lady zama was actually crying out to the public but we did not notice it she really said that she's speaking from experience when she said that a lot of people were divided in the social medias because they just couldn't believe what Lady Zama just tweeted. Because a lot of people, you know, they are fans of Java and they did not know, you know, that there is this side of Java that has never been displayed to the public and now that it has been outed. Do they stop and intervene or do they continue with their lives and not say anything at all? So a lot of people were calling out the people who were just saying, you know what? This abuse thing that happened in the relationship is none of my business. A lot of people call those people out to say that, hey guys, we are living in the most dangerous times of our lives whereby gender-based violence is happening left, right, and center. So guys, that's it for today. Do let me know in the comment section down below what do you think about this shocking revelation that Lady Zama made about her prior relationship to Java. Do let me know in the comment section down below. Like this video or dislike it however way you received it. And otherwise, see you on another TV Scoop Entertainment video. Goodbye.